If you grew up in the 80s or 90s, you certainly remember the side-scrolling beat-em-up. In this genre of game, you only had one mission. Move to the right or the left and whoop somebody's ass. That's it. That's all there was to it. I mean, seriously, if you, if you played these games at home, you probably remember that they elicited some of the worst hand cramps you would ever freaking have. I mean, my goodness. Pressing that button over and over and over and over and over again to punch, to kick, to punch, to kick, to punch, to kick. It was a pain in the ass. All that being said, though, these games were pretty awesome. There was this badass Avengers game, and I remember playing it in an arcade, Aladdin's Arcade. I'll never forget it. I played the hell out of this thing. There were like five characters you could choose from, and you literally were just punch, kick, punch, kick, throw, special power. But I played the hell out of the game, and I think there was an X-Men one, too. But man, oh man, and not even just as a kid, I found a box of that Avengers game when I was at some camping place. I think I went camping with my friend. I think it was on like my senior trip, and we went camping. And, and in the little lodge, they had that freaking arcade. I played the hell out of it. I dumped so many quarters into that thing. My goodness. But it doesn't matter. So, well, one of those games, one of them, was Streets of Rage. Streets of Rage is essentially that. You're, you're a badass MFR. And you're on the streets, and you're pretty upset. You're, you're pretty angry. You're, you're kind of beating the hell out of a bunch of people. You're, you're angry. There was a story to the game. I didn't know there was a story of the game until I started reading about Streets of Rage 4. And I was like, wait, there's a story? And I had to go back, and I had to look. There's a story to this game. But the story doesn't matter. None of that matters. What matters is you walking around and you beating some ass. And that's what, that's what it is. It's a half-assed story. With you beating some people up. Now these games were released on the Sega Genesis, the Sega Master System, and there was even a Game Gear version. And there were three original Streets of Rage games that came out pretty pretty close to each other. And then, 25 years later, randomly, Streets of Rage 4 comes out. Now I'd heard Streets of Rage 4 was coming out, and I was like, nah, you know, whatever. This will probably be, they'll probably abandon the formula. It'll probably be some, you know, half-assed version of what we got originally. But then I saw some video of it, and I was like, you know, this looks pretty interesting. So why not play it? And that's what we're going to do uh, in this next series. We're going to play through Streets of Rage 4 and give our commentary about it. And I also hear there's a major f- a feature film in the works, which is a little weird. I'm not sure how you do a Streets of, Streets of Rage film in 2020. Can't imagine what the woke version of Streets of Rage would look like, but... I'm curious. I'm curious. Who would play Axe? I don't even know. Who knows? Who knows? Anyways, Streets of Rage 4 is said to keep the retro feel of the game while adding in some modern graphics and and, and some modern gameplay. So we're going to check that out. Um, that is what we're going to find out. Does this game encapsulate everything that made the retro beat em up fun, but at the same time change the formula around a little bit so that more modern players can get a lot out of it. Also, does my hand hurt like hell after playing it? Because if it does, this might be 20 part video, because I don't know how I'm gonna get through it if I got a freaking hand cramp the whole time. Anyways, there's only one question left to ask, and that's are you ready? Are you ready for some rage? Some, 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 some outdoor rage? Maybe, maybe in the, in the streets? Are you ready for some outdoor rage in the streets? Some streets of rage? Well, if so, let's get it. Oh my gosh. Boom! Four! Streets of Rage Four! Man, I'm pumped. Woo! Holy moly. Dang. I just gotta take a minute. I just gotta take one minute. Because that introduction, whoo, that thing was fire. My gosh, I feel, my adrenaline's going, I'm feeling amped. I feel like I could get on the streets of rage. Man, whoo. All right, we're gonna get into it. Streets of Rage 4. Um, I'm excited, I'm excited to play this one. I think, I, I'm sure I'll cover this in the intro video, but I've got some fond-ass memories of Streets of Rage, man. I'm not even joking. i got some fond, fond memories of this game. Uh, well, at least the original. This game was dope. This game is dope. And uh, we're going we're gonna to go with it. Uh, story. 
slot one. I'm gonna play a normal. All right, I want to take a minute to talk about the characters. Um, I'm gonna take a minute to talk about the character. There's a hidden character, so we don't know who he is. But we got we got some interesting characters. So Axel, I want to say I remember Axel from the older games, but maybe I'm wrong. Anyway, I like Axel. He's rocking some torn up jeans. He's got the old. Uh, Got the old flannel tied around the ra the waist. Very Raven, very very uh, very Raven esque. I like that. And the denim. I, what I can really appreciate is the denim shirt uh, with the cut off sleeves because his muscles are so big. Uh, Blaze is uh, Blaze. I don't. Cherry. She's got a guitar on her back. She's ready to rock out. And then we got Floyd. And Floyd is. Floyd's got some metal arms. I don't know where those came from. Floyd, to me, looks like a combination of The Rock and Jax from Mortal Kombat. So I don't know if that's what they were going for. Um, I'm going to assume they weren't. I'm going to play as Axel. Still. Just because Axel had such... He had, like, the most badass introduction. Let's start. Let's get this going. Listen to that music. Oh, gosh. Ten years have passed since the fall of Mr. X and his syndicate. The city has been at peace. Until now. Ooh, an emotional Axel. A new crime empire has arisen, corrupting everything good in the city. It is rumored to be led by Mr. X's own children, the Y-Twins. Former detectives Axel Stone and Blaze Fielding join forces with their old friend's daughter, Cherry Hunter, along with Floyd Aya, the apprentice of the brilliant... Dang. Together, these four vigilantes stand against the Y-Syndicate on... The Streets of Rage. And there they are. There's our heroes. Streets of Rage 4. We're about to get into it. So I gotta say, just from the get-go, the music, the music of this game, so far, has been pretty... Here we go. We're starting on the streets. It's been pretty awesome, man. Story. Eh, the story. But you know what? You don't expect to get much of a story. So, okay. So I'm just, like, trying to get... Trying to get used to the controls here. Okay, block. How do I block the other way, though? Some of these even bad guys, like this dude with the mohawk, he reminds me of a dude from the original. Maybe I could be wrong. Oh, you mother. Sorry, I'm still trying to get used to the controls. Okay, so square and triangle are, are... There's your fire move. Looks like that's block. X is jump. Can I pick this up? I can break it. Circles to pick up. Thanks, game. Alright. I'll turn that off. Take that bag of money, baby. Can I sprint? Oh, he had a knife! I didn't even see it! Oh, give me that knife. Oh, specials drain health. I didn't know that. I've been doing the special this whole time. Oh my gosh, I'm getting whomped. I gotta watch out for this dude. Dude's got a knife. Come here. Drop that knife. Pick up. Oh, you can throw him. I can throw it. Watch. Ah. Oh, damn. He had a body slam. You got a body slam, dang! Oh, you mother. So I gotta be careful, because if I do my special, it's gonna drain my health. I wish I would've known that in the beginning. I was using that special pretty liberal, man. I gotta pick this knife up. How's oh, he slide tag on the mother? Dang, we're already down to life. Maybe we should've started on easy. I guess I need to use the block more, huh? So he's gonna block the way... He's not facing. There you go. Oh, I need that, baby. I need that ham. Or turkey. Give me the turkey. 
Yeah, look at that move. 17 hits. Here, give me that. All right, so I want to talk a little bit about the art. Can I pick this up? No. I want to talk about this dude's. Talk a little bit about the art real quick. So I think the game looks pretty great. And I don't know, so it's dark on my screen, but that could just be the settings on my screen, honestly. Or it could be the game, I'm, I'm not sure. My, my screen, I'm playing on a 4K monitor, uh, but it could just be the way I have my monitor set up for Call of Duty. So I probably should have, maybe I should have went in and adjusted the settings on my monitor because it looks dark. I may have to pause and do that and edit this out. Or maybe it's supposed to look this dark. I'm not sure. It might, you know? Stack of cash. I will to take that. Oh, what? Oh, I'm draining my health. I'm sitting there. It's telling me that. I don't think the trigger buttons do anything. I could be wrong, except for block. Well, that was great. Dude, I love the music. It's so good. Look at this, this is gonna allow me to get a big combo. Oh, a big star. Broke up that car, baby. I got a star move. What's a star move? I don't wanna use that yet. I might need to save that star move, so we, we don't wanna use that yet. Come here. Take that knife. I love the music of this game. I'm not even gonna lie, the music is so, if you can hear it. The music captures the mood of the game. There's gotta be a way to pick these up, uh-oh. What is this dude, look at this skull dude. He's got robot legs. He just pulled that out of his chest! He just pulled that out of his chest! What's up with this dude made of pipes? Oh no. I knew that was gonna be legit. Come here. I'm gonna whap him. I'm gonna wallop him. Get this pipe. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna pounce. Move. Come on, Axel. Come on, Axel. Beat him. Beat his ass. Beat his ass. Beat this little friggin' uh. No! Oh, what? What? No! What the hell? Oh, get that. Get that. Get that meat. Get that meat. Get out of the way. Oh, I knew it. Come on, come on, Axel. Oh, do your star move, dude. Oh no, oh no. You messed with the wrong dude, skull boy. Kubu. Knee him in that face. You whoop this dude's ass. Come here. Come here, Skeletor. Broke ass Skeletor. Boom. Go. Oh, we're gonna go, don't you worry about that. We're going. Look how lackadaisical this mother... Look at him. He's got his hands in his pockets. What are you doing just standing there, homeboy? What's... What's he doing? He's just backing away. Backing away. Oh. He just... What? What the hell? Get out of the way. What was that guy? Do? What? 
He's like Orange Cassidy. This motherfucker, he's like Orange Cassidy. What? He keeps coming. What the hell? Get out of here, Orange Cassidy. Nobody wants you here. Jumping out there with your hands in your pocket like a goof. Give me a star. This boy got his pants sagging down. He's like Conan. I love the characters. Oh. It very much is like a traditional beat em up. Oh, look at all these enemies. Now they're giving me a challenge. I wonder if there are continues. Or am I gonna... Oh. I love Orange Cassidy. I love the Orange Cassidy looking dude. I'm gonna pick up this pipe and go in now. Oh, I love this. He didn't expect me to have that pipe. All right, here we go. Pa, boom. What's what's this chick? Diva. She's like the boss. Oh, she's got a oh. Dang. Star move. Whoop her up. Come here, Diva. You don't even know what you're about to get into. Oh, no. Should we soften her up? What do you guys think? Is it time? We got big old turkey. Should we soften her up? I think we need to soften her up. Let's get the fire. Boom. What do you think of that, Diva? I'm gonna get some health. She's got this snake she keeps sending out at me. This sneaky little slithery snake. Come here. I'm gonna whoop you up, girl. I'm gonna whoop you up, girl. Come here. Oh! What? I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't... Oh, no! Oh, she got the... She got the Orange Cassidy gang. She got the Orange Cassidy gang. Get these boys. Oh, no. She kicked me. Oh, no. No, 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 no. You know what? You know what? I've had enough of this. I need to get to that ham. Get to that ham. There you go. Get your ass. Forget these these, go these goons. These goons. Can we throw this dude? He's powering up. Jump. Nope. Nope. Get that pipe. Take out the goons. The goons. What? Oh, she's getting the power. How do you avoid that attack? You just stay away from her, I guess? Oh, nice, nice German suplex. Look that pipe. I like that move. That was a good move. Watch out! There you go. That's how you avoid it. You gotta, you gotta back up. That thing is almost unavoidable, though. And we're out of... Mm. Can we beat her? Can we beat her? Get away! Oh, no. No, 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 no. I knew it. All right, that's cool. That's cool. We still got a life. And we don't, she doesn't have much left. Yep. Mm. Get her out of here. The music is so good, guys. I gotta turn the volume up. I gotta turn the volume up because I want you guys to hear the music. Because it's so good. How can you not? How can you not? Uh. D? How did I get a D? How did I get a D? I was moving and shaking. I did the fire uppercut. I was eating hams and turkeys and 
apples? How did I get a D? I gotta tell you, that D, that D's a little suspect. I don't know. All I'm saying is, y'all be the y'all put it down in the chat. Was that a D? That wasn't a D. We we know it wasn't a D. Y'all don't even need to put it in the chat. That wasn't a D. That wasn't a D. If y'all tell me it was a D, y'all full of it. Cause that wasn't a D. Look at that. We got twelve thousand five hundred sixty-nine final score, time bonus, all that good stuff. Star bonus. We use those stars like it wasn't no thing. What's the high score? Can I hit that? Damn, 63, shit. 63,000? you kidding me, man? 63,000? No wonder I got a D. I only got 12,569 points. Man, I don't know about that. All right, that was stage one. So, uh, my thoughts so far on the game. I love the art. I think it's pretty cool. I like the way the characters, like, move. You know what I mean? Move. I like the music. The music's an A plus, man. This music, this music is popping. So I, I can't say anything about the music. Uh, I don't like that I got a D. I should ding it for that. But it's just your typical side scrolling beat em up, man. It reminds me of uh, the original Streets of Rage and Streets of Rage from way back in the day. I'm not sponsored, I just enjoy a crisp 7 up. And that was fun, man. Alright, we're gonna do another stage. There you go. Took that diva out. Now, diva, tell us what's going on in this city. This new organization, they're too powerful. They control everything and everyone. There's one man who could help you. The Grand Master of Chinatown. He used to be a friend of theirs. Looks like it's too late. They already found you. Axel! Oh, I think that was a chick. I think it was a chick. There you go, man. We got the, we got the, the whole... Squad dropping in on us. Next level is a police precinct. We're gonna tear it down. Look at this. Oh, we're in jail. Oh no, we got the goons around us. Get those goon squads. Start with a little orange Cassidy. I don't know if I like using the D pad better or if I like using the sticks. I think I like the D pad. Oh yeah, whoop them up, baby. Whoop them up, Axel. Don't you let them. Oh damn! Axel! Axel Foley up in this mother. You got some toilet paper. Can I bust the toilet? No, I can't bust the toilet. I like how the backgrounds are just still animation. And you kind of just move around. You bust the axle. And you just... Oh, these guards. You got some guards, Axel. They're tough, boys. Look at those thick guards. Thick police guards. How you go whoop up on these boys? Jump tech. You can't break any of that off. You know these good dudes are going to be breaking out of here. Music though. I don't even want to mess with these boys. I just want to let them have at it. Why is he coming right for me? There were three dudes right beside you. Go for them. You gonna come with me? Boom. Uh-uh. Boom boy. That's how you do it. Oh, I can. I didn't know that. Get that hand. This is a big He got black on. This is a leader. He had a taser! We want that. Give me that taser. I'm about to tase this boy. Oh no, I'm gonna get my ass whipped. Oh, what do you think of that, taser copy? Give me that old copper. Get that boy. You handle him, cop. We team up. Team up for a sec. I need to learn how to block more. These boys, these cops are whooping my ass. Get away from me, cop. You go do him. Why do you keep coming at me? Keep coming. Keep coming. I 
again, you tell me how you can't. This music isn't freaking sweet. What's in here? Oh, yeah, big stack of cash. Oh no, what he's got magic shield? What what what? Alright, this guy's gonna be you gotta watch out. There you go, we broke. Light him up. Take it. Once you get to the shield, he's just like everybody else. Alright, we ready. Let's go up these steps. Up to the top of the precinct. We're gonna try and get out. This is music. Can I bust? I can bust this machine. No? Excuse me, gents. You're in my way. Nothing against you, but you're in Axel's way. And Axel's gotta get out of here. We got some business to take care of. We got those old Y boys or Y girls or Y kids. Is there a way I can get behind him? There's gotta be a way I can get behind him, right? Yeah, he's slick. I couldn't jump. I couldn't jump. My hand's cramping. Now we were behind him. That oh, you're in trouble now, buddy. I should have kept. Oh no, I should have kept. I should have kept Orange Cassidy alive, huh? He pulled out an. Oh. So you gotta handle these boys fast, or they'll pull out another one. Alright, come here. Alright, we got him. Oh, what? That was so fast! Why was that guy so fast? Alright, come here. I'm gonna let you arrest me, cop. Axel's in the building. And he needs to get out. Y'all made a mistake arresting me. Mm. Number one mistake of the day. Don't mess with Axel. Axel Stone. This mother. Now it's. I knew it was coming. Nice, we broke it. Get him. Ooh, no, gun, gun, gun. About to let these boys have it. Those cops taking care of business over here for me. Uh oh, you know we're about to have a... Oh! Oh! Tell you what I don't like. I don't like this. You know what? It's time. Probably gonna regret it. But... Oh, we lost it. Where are we 
got? All right, we're on our final life, guys. Oh, he's dead. Look at that. Okay. We got a new life. Take this billy club with us because we might need it. Who's this? Oh! Commissioner! Come here. Tell you what, Commish. He's bringing his goons. Oh, he's got his, he's got his cops. They're in here. Get off me. Oh, he's got... Oh! Commish don't play. Come here, Commish. Man, when he gets you, he's tough. Alright, come here, Commish. What's this? What's this? He's got a super move. He's got a super move. Oh no! No, he's got this move. He's nice too. That move is even worse. I almost like his dodge attack better. Alright, that's it. We gotta do it. I didn't wanna do it. We gotta do it. It didn't. Star moves over right now. Now we gotta move. Because I wanna get. If I get far away, he'll do that. And then that gives me, I can attack him, it opens him up. It's when he comes at you and he does this thing. That's what's tough. Oh no, oh no, 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 we lost. Game over. Do we get to continue? We can retry. We gotta do the whole level. Oh my gosh, we gotta do the whole level. We gotta do the whole freaking level. Ugh. Oh my gosh, why is he so hard? There's gotta be a... You know he's coming. Alright, he's gonna come up to you. Watch out. Okay. Slam him. Get back. I don't know how to, what do I do to avoid that? Alright, he's gonna wind up. Come. Get him! Let's go, baby! Let's go! That's it. What did I get that time? A C! We're improving! We are improving! Alright! 
All right. C's not bad. Thumb is killing me, man. C's not bad. All right, look. Hey. Hey. C's not bad. We might switch characters for the next couple stages. Hey, but that's it for this video. My initial thoughts after playing two levels. I only died once. That's not bad. You have to start the level over when you die. So that's... That's something. I mean, that's fine. That's a mechanic that they, they chose to go with. I would say that's fine. Um, it's pretty fun, man. I mean, it's a, it's a classic beat-em-up. There's no real bells and whistles to it. It is what it is. Uh, you know, button mash, button mash, button mash, button mash, and then you get a special attack. Button mash, button mash, button mash. That's basically what it is. The characters are cool. The backgrounds are cool. The music is really cool. The music is like a 10 out of 10. Um... But that's it for this video. This is part one. We'll play like the next two stages in part two. And then we'll do like the final stage and my final thoughts on this game as a whole. Alright. Uh, this game was pretty expensive for what it is so far. But I heard that there's a retro mode too where you can go back and play as like retro versions of the characters. So it'll be cool to check that out and try that out. Um, but that's it for today. If you like this video, please choose to subscribe. Please like this video. Please comment on this video. What do you think? Uh, if you've played Streets of Rage 4, if you've played the old ones, maybe comparisons. I would love to know what you think because I've got my own thoughts that I'm going to share at the beginning of this video and then at the, at the end when we do the full review. So I've got my thoughts too. I can't wait to hear yours. Again, if you like it, like the video, subscribe. Check the little dingy notification thing. Uh, so that'll let you know when we upload new videos. We're going to try to upload weekly. Um, sometimes that's going to happen, sometimes it's not, because life is life. Uh, but again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time in another Street to Rage 4. Luda Carson, out. If you like this video, please just slap a like on it. Slap a like right on that boy. Trust me, it won't feel it. And if it does, might even like it. Feel free to subscribe if you want to see more of my content. Maybe you like me. Maybe, maybe you're like, hey, that guy's a, he's a pretty nice fella. Pretty, pretty good, pretty well put together boy. Uh, if you think that, you, you go ahead and uh, subscribe. Uh, we'll hopefully be adding more content weekly. Hopefully. I say hopefully because you never know. But, hopefully. Ping the notification bell so that you know when a new video is posted. How are you going to know if you don't know? Also, comment on the video. Let me know what you think. I want to know what you think about everything. The world, Star Wars. We really need to talk about Star Wars. We always should be talking about Star Wars. What did Disney do to Star Wars?